At least I don't think I did. The Office of Naval Intelligence Sword Base is presently under siege from a Corvette-class Covenant vessel. Due to the sensitive nature of this facility, use of orbital rounds has been, for the moment, prohibited. Regrettably, my efforts to obtain relevant data on enemy forces have been unsuccessful. However, current defensive forces are insufficient. Only has requested Team Noble's direct intervention to help secure Sword Base. All right, people. We're stuck with that ship for the time being. Let's focus on the hostile infantry. Give those troopers a hand. Cat Six, you're out here. George Miel, you're next to prep. Let's move, Lieutenant. So we tried to do this screen twice the other day. My audio got a little weird and cracky. Um, I'm Cat it's going Six, to push back the attack right on now. sword base. We'll Find out what we're out. dealing with. Roger that. Bring your strike team. Hostiles north. Sit on this, buddy. Knock some heads, Lieutenant. Hold on. You. No. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Now. Good. Enemy contact, Spartans. Comms array has a working generator. 
close to the AA gun.
This is Noble Leader. Get back to Sword Base ASAP. Spartans, return to sword base. The rest of your team is inbound, imminent. Okay. Oh, Noble, be advised. Covenant Corvette moving into position. Cat, nice six. shot, dude. Get here quick. We'll meet you inside. No way. in the tower atrium. Cat, where are you? I'm 
the salvo from that Corvette. Kill those yeah. Banshees. Swords are inbound and ready to push. Orbital Defense is standing by to take the shot. Sounded like you said Halsey. I did. Copy that on our way. Don't need command to tell me. Been all hers half my life. I requested your assistance, Commander, and do not need a report on events that occur on my own doorstep. What I do require is a detailed account of your previous engagement. George, it's been too long. Mom. What have you done with my armor? Just some additions I've made. Indeed. Visegrad Relay. Its data center was home to one of my Xeno archaeologists, Professor Laszlo Sorvad. Perhaps you could shed some light on his death. If he was a civilian male in his mid-sixties, he died with a Covenant energy sword through his abdomen. Elites, then. They engaged us as well. It was just, uh... Just after we found your scientist's daughter, Mom. She was hiding in the air. Uh... The elites. Tell me more about them. Three. Zealot class. One got Bias. The leader, from the looks of him. Zealots. You're certain? Their armor configuration matched. Shield strength, too. I gave the order not to pursue. Our primary objective was to get the station's relay back online. Your primary objective? Commander, are you a puppet or a Spartan? Ma'am? There are those at Oni, myself included, who believe the Covenant dispatch elite advanced teams to hunt down artifacts of value to their religion. Survivor accounts suggests such teams are small, nimble, and almost always zealot class. No doubt they came to the station for the abundance of Oni excavation data stored there. And you let them get away. Data retrieval was not a command directive. Even had we known, we had other more urgent matters to attend to. Like warning the planet. Professor Sorvad's final entry in his field notes made reference to a latchkey discovery. Latchkey. Not a word he would use lightly. So let's hope that the data module your lieutenant commander stole contains it. Cat? Before you ask, I was alerted the moment you attempted to access its contents, as I am with any unauthorized tap. That data is classified Tier 1. 
I could send you to the brig for interfering with my work. Maybe you'd like to join her. I'm sorry? We're currently under emergency planetary directive. Winter contingency? I'm sure you're familiar with the punishment for civilian interference with the Spartan deployment. Are you threatening me, Commander? Just making a reading suggestion, ma'am. Let's move, noble team. Mom? That will be all, George. 